Children's safety is the most important thing. But that safety is at risk. Our cameras catch drivers failing to stop for school buses. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Deb Ferris. And I'm Jim Grimes. We are well into the school year, and by now you would think drivers are used to seeing all those school buses on the roads. But what Cakes Brian Ramsdale found out is too many people are driving around those stop school buses and putting our kids in danger. Dale Bollinger has been driving a school bus for three years, and his bosses say he's good at it. Lights are working. Each day he goes through a checklist, making sure the bus is safe to drive. But the one thing he can't control are the others driving around him, many of them always in a rush. Some guy decides, hey, the boss is going to fire me if I'm late for work again, and he goes, we could have a disaster. To see what he means, we follow him on his route. It didn't take very long. He stops on a busy road. The signs of the bus are clearly visible, warning drivers to stop. But Boom. watch what happens right next. There. Right there, that person just ran that, and they had everything. That car steering stop. around the bus is breaking the law. If a police officer saw that, the driver would be slapped with a $315 fine. Bullinger says despite the stiff fine, this happens every day. In fact, on a day in April, bus drivers were asked to count the violators. At the end of the day, 438 drivers had broken the law. YouTube is filled with videos showing close calls. This one, a speeding truck almost runs over three children. We didn't see anything this bad, but what we did see should make any parent concerned. This is 908's last route. These are the young kids here, and the bus driver says that one of these stops that he's going to be making is one of the most dangerous ones, and he thinks that somebody will end up illegally passing this school bus where we have very, very young kids. We're talking kindergarten age, and the risk of somebody hurting them is apparently pretty high at this apartment complex he's getting ready to go to. Now watch. Cars on both sides of the roads fail to stop or recognize the bus. Almost on every stop, they just carelessly just drive through. The most important thing is I got to be able to sleep at night. And if, if anything ever happened to a kid on one of my routes, I don't know I could do that. Now, if you're confused by the law, all you need to know is that when a bus extends its stop signs and the lights are flashing red, you need to stop, whether you're behind the bus or coming from the other direction, even if you're on a four or six lane road without a median. Live in the studio, Brian Ramsdale, Cake News.